Hi there, welcome back to number one geek. It is I, Saz, and we are back with some more projects on board. Yes, I know. It's kind of gone to a bi weekly sort of thing. I've just been a very busy boy. So uh, it was the choice between this and RimWorld, and uh, last week it was RimWorld. I was just in the mood, mood for a bit more RimWorld than I was. But the only consequence of that is, is that I've completely and utterly forgotten what it is that uh, I was doing. I think I was trying to get my electronics up, wasn't I? Or, or, so I could uh, hotwire some cars. My mechanics, I think. So I have to find some cars to take apart. But then again, my skill points need raising. So that might also be what I was up to. Looking for a bit of trouble. As you do. So uh, we're just going to end up... Actually, was I looking for... Um... Maybe I was looking... Oh, I think I might have been looking for lanes manuals. Because I was having a particular issue. Oh, that's interesting. Two hunting rifles, that's a bit greedy, don't you think, mate? I'll eat some cheese. No, it's getting quite dark outside. At least I've eaten. Was I getting my sprinting up as well? I think I might have been. So I was looking for lanes manuals. Now, a shed like this would be quite good, but I think that has a metal door on it. So, unless it's actually open. Well, blow me backwards. Bit of duct tape, always useful. Some charcoal. Toys on mine. Have a bit of that. Don't happen to have any lanes manuals on your desiccated corpse, do you? Let's get a bit closer. Uh, let's take the glass out the window. The nice thing is, is that we are definitely starting to see a lot less in the way of zombies right now. That may not be the case elsewhere, but we it could be a sign that we are slowly getting ourselves all chocolate. Everyone likes a bit of chocolate. Beef jerky. Anybody in here? No? Good. Right, anyone seen the lanes manuals around here? Anyone at all? Let's go back here. It's like a double door here. Oh, it's a patio door. That's quite cool. a sheet of paper. That ain't gonna help me. Oh, is there a dead body here? 
Do some more rounds. Can I not pick up any more? Looks that way. Okay, that's fine. Let's. Looks like I may have been in here. Don't know why, because all the doors are open. Mainly. Is what I thought. But I don't think I'm gonna find myself a lanes manual in here. No sorry Bob. Oh maybe if I get oh Hello. There's a lone zombie. Right, let's try the posh houses then, shall we? Now, most likely, alarms are going to go off here because posh houses will look after themselves. Let's see. Good news when the power fails, at least the alarms stop alarming. Even though if you think about it, if the power fails, then a lot of alarms will go off because they have like a battery. Oh, sugar, sugar. Looks like I found a couple of uh, dead ends. And it didn't make me jump. Nope, totally didn't make me jump. Turn you off. How does it feel like I've actually been here before? You, you fall over lanes, manuals. Left, right and bloody centre. And then as soon as you need one, just as soon as you need one, can you find one? No. No, you can't. Oh, there is a shed back here, though. It's always good to know. Oh, I found another fishing rod, wood glue, yep. I'm a bit disappointed, to be honest. When a man's looking for a lanes manual, Last thing he wants is a pot of glue. No zombies in there. There was one in there though. Ooh, a 
there's an office here. Maybe a Lane's manual might be in newspaper, magazine, first day for beginning. No. Disappointment. That's all that's happening today. It's just disappointment. In the home office. Oh. I think my sneak's getting quite good. Any more for any more? Lane's manual. There's an electronics magazine, which I've already read. About a pit, no empty notebook. It's a nice bathroom. But then again, we are in the hoi floi, hooty tooty, fluty section. Which is why I'm very surprised no alarms have gone off yet. Also, it isn't bad doing a house to house clearance either. Ooh, nice big bookshelf. Oh, hello. Have a bit of that sunshine. Engineers magazine already read. How about this one? Carpentry for beginners. Already read that one, bollocks it. Yep. So no. Disappoint, much disappoint again. A welding mask. Keep a note on that just to see if I haven't got a welding mask at home because I need to do some welding and stuff. I do have a place where I can practice my welding. I'm getting tired as well, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a bed, make sure it's safe up here. Looks like I'm sleeping in the child's bedroom. Close those curtains. Close those curtains. So I can't be seen. And we'll go to sleep. Okay. I'm in a bit of a panic. Which must mean... Look, there's zombies nearby. Hold on a second, the Metal Work magazine. Oh, I've already read that one. Okay. I read that. So that's not really helpful. Ah, that might be the reason why. <coughs> Excuse me. It's time to visit my adoring fans. Is there anything decent on these zombies? Looks like the answer's a big fat no. Okay, well, let's... Anything on you? There's a screwdriver. There's a back end over here. 
Is there a lanes manual? I need a lanes manual. Yeah. He came out of nowhere, didn't he? All up in my business. Couple of bookshelves here, if we're lucky. Trapping. Uh, trapping. I've not really done a lot of trapping. I've I've never really had the um the lice. Oh, hello. To to actually do trapping and stuff. Because most of the time, the food's there. Having said that, that foraging, trapping, and all that lot, they're probably important skills once like. Fridges stop working. No, I did look over here, didn't I? Yes, Master Foraging. Yeah. Until these open doors worry me. It makes me think I've already been in here. Right, am I lucky enough to find a lanesman? I need to find a library, really, don't I? Nothing there. Empty notebook, magazine. Well, poop pants. Another key. Right, well, I suppose in one way I am systematically cleaning out these big houses. Which I suppose is a good thing, really. Now, I just wonder if, if some of these keys has allowed me to open some of these doors now. There we go. Uh, so obviously we've just... Oh, I hear zombies. You scared me? Am I scared? Is there zombies outside or something? Oh no, it's over there. I'm trying to cook his meal by the looks of it. But I'm not going to let you. Ooh, ice cream. Have a bit of you. Nom nom nom. There we go. Right, is there a lanes manual in here? At all, perhaps. No, but there is a pool queue. Next to useless. Well, not totally useless. I already read that one. Ah, found another office. Oh, a lanes manual. Is that the one? I... Oh. I may have found it, folks. I think. I think I. I think I found it. Right. Oh, hello. Didn't see you over there. There you go. the key. Did I see a first aid kit around here somewhere? Right. Oops. 
slightly overweight. Well, I think I've done what I needed to do. So it's time to get back to the car. While we're at it. <clears throat> now you go back to the people who've been shooting like crazy. Come to me, my pretties. Come to me. The interesting thing I've discovered is, if you can't see zombies, then you can't be better scared of them. Even if you know that they're right behind you. How screwed up is that, eh? Oh, I need to get back onto the main road. She's probably back here because that's the river. It's an ice cream shop. Oh, yeah. Have a bit of that. Now, if I look at this van here, just to make 100% sure, because the last thing I want to do is start thinking that I've been successful in my attempts to uh, remove stuff. Car key is required, apparently, to uninstall the hood. However... Apart from the car key required, I do have the stuff that I can use to do it because I've, I've booked up that lanes manual. So I think we can safely say There's a car thing that comes up. There we go. Nothing in the glove compartment. Oops. Right, so I didn't do that. Just let you know. Now I should. Be able to install the windshield. Well, there you 
you go. Look at that. Let me bring up my uh, skills as well. 48.5. Actually, what I'll do is I'll probably have a windshield, uh, a hood, yeah. So I'm just going to pop that down. <sighs> so much fail. and it's still the rear wheel and shield then keeping my eyes out for any sort of zombies failure no So I think the only problem is, is that you don't, the only way that you're going to get it is by actually being successful. The chance of success is actually 5%, so I can understand why I'm not doing that. It might actually be a better idea for me to maybe go for something with a little bit higher chance. There you go. Three out of seventy five. First things first, let's throw these front doors out. That front window. Because we don't need that sort of. Is uh... oh, that a bad chance there? What's the chance? 20%. Well, that's okay. 20% is better than. 5% at least. Well, let's take out the headlights. It's always easy to take out the headlights. Six. Look at that. We we're, we're cooking with gas now. All right. First things first. Let's get rid of the light bulbs. And where are we? Car battery. Yeah, we don't want that car battery because that's just way too heavy. Uh, my trunk. Can we do that? Part info. No trunk lid. Can we install that? So that's a 35% chance. Awesome source. Not just success. Now that means that, oh no, maybe not. Let me find this trunk lid and get rid of it. What else have we got here that we can take apart? Uh, let's take the radio out. Why not? And take the glove box out? No. We can take this driver's seat out though. Sounding like a success. Ah, 
standard seat. Ah, there's the radio there. So let's dismantle that radio. How are we doing? 6125. But it is getting dark. I do have some uh, cars back at my home base that I can uh, I can more than likely repair and take apart So we're back on the main high street. I'm pretty sure I left a vehicle up here. I did. Mine's veteran Angus. Just gotta remember, this car goes a lot faster, and there's a second set of cars that I always crash into at the end of this road. Which, in all fairness, I do maybe want to think about taking apart or repairing so I can move them. So it's down here. Just gotta be quite careful. I know it's here somewhere. Okay, so now we can start driving normally. Huzzah! Okay, I should be turning any taking that. Slow myself down.
Whoops. You didn't see that. Alright. I could edit this out, but... I think some meat will actually just come from my stupidity. Oosh. Just missed that tree by a hair's whisker. Interesting. Oh, excuse me, I do apologise. I'm going to put the lane source manual there. And a light bulb. And a radio receiver. Oops. Let's just put some uh, of the weapons in here, shall we? I know I put them downstairs. I think it's just going to be easy just to put stuff. for gun size. No, we've got some here though. Some more shotgun shells. Mm, boom, boom, boom. Box of 9 mil. See that peanut butter? Folks, I think what we're going to do is maybe do a bit of rest.
so let's uh, have a look at this car here. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, I could get blade maintenance, but I really want the mechanics. So let me uninstall this. Okay, so what was that now? 62. Now if I install it now. What's that? So doing the same thing isn't going to work. Right. So if I now install the light bulb at the front. How are we doing now? 65.75. Cool, cool. Uh, let's try installing the hood. <coughs> That's a failure. It's another failure. Eep. Right, I'm damaging that too much now. So let's pick on this car instead. Now we're we at 65.75. Oh, there's a missing battery there. Hold on a second. Is there a battery over here? That might be the reason what? Mm, four light bulbs. Sixty-six point five. Awesome source. Let's install these light bulbs, shall we? Let's try and install the window, shall we? Ooh, there you go. Try again. Let's try the front right window, because that's got more damage on it. So, at least give us a better chance. Oh, success! Look at that. Now where's that window, front window type sport? Yeah, put that down on the floor. So let's take the front right door off. Oh, that's only 20% chance of success. What about that? That's 5%. Let's yeah, let's try taking that off. No. Try 
Try again. We're actually pretty damn close, to be honest. Well, there you go. And let's see if we can actually install this back on. Which may, if we're lucky, There we go. Oh, so close. Let's try installing the window back on. Okay, so that's a 75. All I need to do now is get my next skill points. <laughs> So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to drop off here and spend some time running around in a big circle. Then we can get some skill points, do some foraging and stuff. So that'll be fun, but I'm not going to bore you guys with it. So I just want to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you like, press the like button. If you dislike what you dislike, please press the dislike button. But please pop something in the comment section to let me know how I can improve my content for you. Because basically making this entertaining for you guys is, is what I'm, I'm here for. And if you really, really, really like it, then uh, please uh, feel free to uh, press the subscribe button and uh, hang out with my nonsense. Whatevs. Okay, guys. Uh, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.